Hey guys, Red Llama here. So in today's video, we're going to set up dual mining on ETH and also Lithium. In order to create a wallet, you have to go to lithium.org to create a wallet here. And it has great information on how to create the wallet. Just make sure you save your passphrase and your password on paper or somewhere else where it's easy to access. Okay, so once you create the wallet, go here and we'll have to add this wallet. Add wallet. Okay, so we added the wallet. Now we can go back here. And I have one rig that has a bunch of low hash rate cards. So let's go to that rig. It's Little Llama. So there's only one low hash rate card on here. So let's update this flight sheet to include a lithium. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that word correctly, but yes. <laughs> All right, so we're looking at it at the flight sheet for this one worker that has one LHR card on it. So we're gonna update it to have lithium. <laughs> We're going to add the wallet. We're going to add the pool. Uh, we're going to do a pool version. And we're going to do intensity. Let's see, the intensity could be... We're going to leave it blank to auto-tune. And we're going to update and see what happens. So we're not going to do this to all workers. We're just going to create a new flight sheet for this one worker. So we're going to choose this option here. All right, so it's the flight sheet has been updated and let's take a look. I'm not sure what it's going to do with these full hash rate cards, the TI and the super, but we'll see what happens there. All right, so first thing is <laughs> this is not going to work because I'm on uh, version 6212 and in order to get this working, I have to be on the on at least this 6.213 version in order to have dual mining on T-Rex miner with both Ethereum and, and the other coin. I can't pronounce it now. So it's not gonna do anything here. So we need to update this. So let's just force upgrade this now. All right, so it's been a few minutes and nothing's really happening right now. So we're gonna open up the shell and see if there's anything that uh, is going on in here. So what we have to type in is miner. And we see that there's a bunch of errors going on right now so let's uh <laughs> let's fix something here so i just saw in red panda's video that he had changed the flight sheet to the following where he was able to get it hashing so let's try uh 68 just like he had done we're going to create this as a new flight sheet i uh, probably just created another one damn it all right well i'll I'll delete, I'll delete this one we don't need two of them Okay, so let's go back to overview and let's see if this actually fixes it. Oh, okay, there we go. I think that was it. Just using the intensity 68 actually helped. So now we can see both or all three cards now. This is the low hash rate card. These two are full hash rate cards. So I'm curious to see what happens when you have full hash rate cards on this flight sheet. Okay, so the full, full hash rate cards are getting split out. So I don't want that to happen. I want these two cards to just stay on ETH and then this one to be on ETH and also the other coin, which I can't pronounce sometimes. So we're going to try 0, 0, 68. And we're going to update this worker. So I'm hoping that this would just be, it won't do anything to these first two cards and then do the intensity of 68 on the last card, which is the low hash rate card. So let's update it. Let's do all workers because this is the only worker that has this flight sheet right now. And let's see if that changes it. So these are both on ETH only. And this is just on uh, Ethereum. All right, so we're one step closer. <laughs> now he just turned off the first two cards and the last one is working. Oh, there we go. Actually, it just you just got to give it some time to, to update. All right, there we go. So now we got... The first two cards are full hash rate cards on ETH. The last card is on a dual miner, which is on ETH and Ethereum. And there we go. We got it working now. And the only thing we had to do is just that slight modification to the flight sheet. But there we go. It's it's hashing away. Now, in order to double check if you're hashing, you have to go to the pool. So let's double check the flight sheet. We're on woolly woolly pulley so let's go there all right so we're just checking if it's hashing on the wallet we we do see it's a 
this wallet has a, a little bit of a hash rate but it's probably still updating so you can see here we have um, quite a bit right now but it's gonna take some time for it to average out a little bit better but yeah it's it's hashing away on this uh, on this pool now so it's going pretty well so we are able to change this or modified so it can work with both um, full hash rate cards and low hash rate cards all right so there we go guys um, it's mining it's still mining both uh, ethereum and ethereum I'm still not pronouncing it right but it's doing both on this rig and we have a mix of full hash rate and low hash rate cards so there is a way to kind of split it out so you don't have to have everything on a dual mining all right guys so i hope this helps out please check out red panda's video on this and also serpent tech that's it guys uh hope you appreciate this please hit the like button on this uh subscribe if you want to see more content like this and i'll see you guys in the next one